Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, my name is Ivy. Uh, my major is fashion merchandising. And uh, today I want to introduce you uh, man, a woman. He, her name is uh, Tegan Otero. Uh, she's an American stand-up comic. Uh, before my presentation, I want to uh, take. Uh, tell you a uh, little story. I think a couple months uh, he, in one night he was very hungry uh, and uh, opened uh, he, his freezer, found that there was nothing to eat. Then he decided to uh, to the uh, food store to buy some, but it was closed when he got there. Uh, and then he decided to uh, take uh, decided to go home. Uh, uh, in his halfway, in his halfway ho to home, uh, it was it's uh, it's starting to rain. Um, suddenly, uh, then he went uh, through. Um, when he got home, uh, he wanted to take a shower, but but he found that uh, the uh, watch is uh, wasn't available. Uh, what do you think, old man? Uh, how how pathetic he is. Um, um, uh, I, I feel compassion uh, for this man. Uh, in China, there there uh, was um, one sentence: uh, "Is a house leakage? Uh, house leakage is land made of of rain uh, of the same night." Uh, most of people know that means is uh, it, it's uh, usually describe uh, a um, one person always. Uh, always uh, suffers many difficult problems uh, at the same time. Uh, now I want to take uh, uh, talk about uh, Take uh, She uh, is uh, an American stand-up comic. She was uh, interviewed by Terry Gross, Gross of Fresh Air on October 8, uh, 2012. Uh, she is uh, 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 take to Paro. <coughs> uh, she loves to make make uh, people laugh. Uh, she, uh, you mean she was a guest on the uh, on the on the actor of this American Life that was shown shown live in movie theater. Uh, in August, uh, she was diagnosed uh, with uh, breast breast cancer, uh, both breasts, um, and uh, she had a double mastectomy. Uh, before this, she got. Uh, and uh, and, uh, and uh, as a consequence of that, uh, CDF is a is a really horrible bacterial infection. Um, infection. Uh, after after she got out of the hospital, uh, her her mother died in a, a break in a freak accident. Um, uh, then he. Then, then he, she broke up with her girlfriend, and uh, um, um, a girlfriend. Um, it's enough to put everything, everything to uh, in your life on hold. But right after the, after uh, she diagnosed this, uh, uh, he here breast breast cancer. Uh, she decided to show. Uh, here regular uh, comedy show uh, at uh, Lago in uh, Los Angeles. Uh, now I will show you one minute of the uh, uh, co co comedy nights. Sorry, it's not work. Um, uh, um, uh, comedian. Uh, community take notaro dealt with uh, his uh, cancer uh, use uh, use uh, humor humor way uh, to deal with his cancer. Um, um, uh, good evening, hello. I have cancer. How are you? That's that's how community take notaro uh, began his start at Lago uh, in Los Angeles. Uh, the day she uh, diagnosed uh, with uh, stage two cancer. Uh, uh, she wants to feel and uh, seems strong. Um, I want to show you this. Mm. Uh, 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 uh,
do you have it on your um, iTunes? Is it there? Yeah, keep. Right there. On this. just where I am in the equation. Oh, it's fine. I, uh, well, I'll, here's what happened. I went, I'm going to get, it's very personal. Found a lump. Guys, relax. It's fine. I have cancer. After I heard the, the acceptor of, of taking a tyros company side, I feel I uh, it's so hard to imagine uh, one person can handle all of these difficult uh, uh, problems. Uh, in during four months, he, uh, she uh, experienced uh, um, breast cancer, uh, pneumonia, bacterial infection, uh, broke away with her girlfriend, and uh, her mother's death. Uh, all of these things are upon one person. Um, um, uh, she, uh, Nick Tignatara also felt, felt uh, very nervous, brittle, and, uh, uh, and uh, very nervous. Uh, but um, no matter uh, who suffers uh, this, he will be devastated. Uh, Tignatara felt very nervous, brittle, and very vulnerable, but she defeated all of these uh, problems. And uh, he, uh, she, uh, to stand uh, on the stage to make a comic show for people uh, again. Uh, even though I felt uh, uh, feel very, very, uh, uh, very sad for taking time, but more about my feelings, admiration. I think um, uh, I'm grateful that I have a healthy body. Uh, my family, my friends, uh, they are healthy. Um, uh, in most cases, when people own something, they always uh, they always tend to uh, ignore it. Uh, just like uh, we, uh, you're we're easier to cover with our family or our friends. Um, people always say uh, we uh, we really hurt someone uh, who we love and uh, they love us too. Uh, so I think. Um, I think we should. Um, um, uh, so from now on, we should cherish what we have, what we have now, uh, uh, like healthy, like a healthy body, uh, uh, our family, our friends, our jobs, and uh, um, don't come um, and don't com complain uh, about uh, uh, life. Um, and uh, I think we should, we also should uh, see every opportunity to do what we, uh, we want to. And, uh, um, and uh, um, that's all what uh, I'm seeing from the interview of Technotar. Uh, especially, uh, at last, especially I want to uh, s uh, see one sentence uh, uh, for all ladies present, cherishing your breasts and uh, Make a healthy life. Uh, uh, thank you for listening. Do you have any questions? 